So now you know what are the costs of quality. When you actually go through the text and read, do you think that cost of quality is expensive? From the research, they said that, like I said, there are two types of cost of quality, cost of actually making good product or cost of, um, of actually fixing bad product, right? The research say that the cost of fixing the bad product is accounted for about 20 to 30 percent of the revenue of the firm, while if you actually spending on trying to make sure your product or your process is producing a good quality product, is account to only two to three percent of your revenue. So which one would you rather actually pay? It's very simple when you think about it that way, in the research way. Of course, you actually want to pay the cost of quality of preventing the damage from happening. Now, when you actually put on those costs, such as prevention costs or appraisal costs, you know, all those monitoring or the prevention that we actually put in place so defect do not happen. When you actually embed, embedded all of that cost into your system, quality is free. Yes, quality is free. So please think about it carefully though. If you actually think everyone in the organization think about quality first, total quality management, TQM, then quality is actually free because it's your normal way of doing business. Thank you.